fox12.com. Tonight, there is an underground menace moving through some areas of Brookhaven, a plume of toxic contamination. Our Virginia Huey shows us now where it came from and how far it spread. It's just beyond belief that we would have been drinking all of that. Karen Hassan of Brookhaven says she was disgusted when she saw this brown water coming out of her well water pipes. She fears it's the reason why her 24-year-old son, Danny, is so sick. My son is suffering from um, chronic Lyme, and he's got all sorts of elevated metals in his system. Hassan says she believes her water may have been contaminated by a chemical plume from the town of Brookhaven landfill. The problem started in 1980. Chemical waste from the trash started seeping through the landfill liners here at the Brookhaven landfill into the ground. There's all sorts of medical waste. There's been um, things dumped from Brookhaven lab, radioactive. Hassan says the town isn't doing enough to track the path of the plume. They've been very proactive, very... Aggressive. But the town says they've been monitoring the plume twice a year since it was discovered. Waste Management Commissioner Ed Hubbard says temporary groundwater monitoring wells have been used for the past six weeks. We're going to go to the area that we think it is and then expand out and then, you know, really delineate the, the extent of the plume. Test results are expected in June. Hubbard says residents with public water are not affected. The town offered to switch homeowners with well water to public water. Hassan made the switch last year, but still feels uneasy living so close to the source of the plume. If the market were better, we'd be gone. In Brookhaven, Virginia Huey, News 12, Long Island. What do you want? The town says about 20 houses with wells were offered to make the switch to public water. Right now, it is 10 minutes after 5 o'clock. Time for our first look at your Long Island forecast. And you know, we